Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. Today I'll show you guys how to transfer music tracks from your laptop or a computer to the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 quick and easy. So let's get started. If you are someone new to our channel, please consider subscribing to our channel as we do regular videos for rare smartwatches like this one, smartphone reviews, tech tutorials and much more. We have an entire playlist full of Samsung smartwatch videos, be sure to check it out. Now I have paired my Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 to my latest iPhone SE 2020 to do a pairing video which will be live in a few days so stay tuned by subscribing. However the point is unlike the Android smartphones you cannot directly transfer songs from your iPhone to the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2. By the way if you have an Android phone you can directly transfer songs and images from your phone to your Samsung smartwatch for which I have done a video linked up here in case if you guys want to check it out once you're done watching this one. However, as you can see here, since transferring music files from your iPhone to Active 2 is not possible directly, I will show you exactly how to do it from your laptop or a computer. Now step one for that is to turn on Wi-Fi on your Samsung Galaxy smartwatch. Mostly the Wi-Fi is either off or on auto mode, both of which are recommended for a better battery life. But for the transfer purpose, I would recommend to turn the Wi-Fi on for a seamless transfer and sometimes in auto mode it can lose the signal or connect to another access point. Once done, make sure to switch back to the auto mode to save battery life. Step 2 is you have to connect your Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 to the same Wi-Fi network on your laptop or computer. This is crucial as if not connected properly you will not even get the music manager. Now make sure you connect to 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi network on both your Active 2 and the laptop. Step 3 go on the music app of your Samsung smartwatch. Now make sure to select your watch and not your phone from this icon. Now once you are on the watch, scroll up and go all the way at the bottom to find the music manager. Once you click on it, you get a prompt to start. When you click start, it will display you a link which you have to type it up in a web browser. It's basically an IP address. Lastly, step number four, go on your computer, open any web browser, in my case it's Google Chrome. Simply type the link up exactly as what it shows on the Active 2. Once you type it right, you will get a welcome page and a prompt on Active 2 to confirm pairing. And once you confirm, you'll be taken to this home page of the music manager. Now the home page is very distinctive and easy to use. On the top left you will see how many tracks are currently on your watch and how much storage space do they occupy. So I have only this much amount of space left. Now on the top right you will see two buttons to delete tracks or add new tracks. Now you can bulk delete tracks by clicking this to select all or you can individually select all the tracks whichever works for you. Now it's not just the music tracks, you get other details like title, artist, albums, length, time and file size which I personally appreciate as I can delete tracks which are larger in size to create more room. Now to add tracks, just click this button and the file manager will open and you can select the destination folder from where you want the songs to be transferred to the watch. Again, you can select all by pressing the shortcut Ctrl plus A or individually select the one you like. And once you are ready, just hit open and the files will be instantly added to your watch. Only MP3 file formats will work. So if you were to add any other file format, it may not work. Keep that in mind. I have seen the transfer process is lightning fast as it all happens over Wi-Fi and there is no middleman like a third party app or even your phone. It's straight from your laptop's web browser to your watch. It's that simple and secure provided you do it all on your home Wi-Fi network and not on a public Wi-Fi network. It's even faster than transferring files from your Android phone to the Active 2. So that's it with the transferring process. Now. To transfer images, you can do it from either an iPhone 
or an Android phone, just click the send images and the album gallery will open. Select all the images that you want and click send. Again, please make sure that your watch is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your phone. The process will be blazing fast or else it will happen over automatically by Bluetooth, which is inherently slower than the Wi-Fi. So that's it with this video. I really hope you found this video helpful. Please subscribe as there are more awesome videos like this on the way. And please give this video a thumbs up and maybe give it a thumbs up anyways as an appreciation to our effort for making this video. It really means a lot. Thank you so much for watching and take care. I'll catch you guys in the next one.